Welcome to another video walk around. Today we're going to be looking at the new Toyota Highlander XLE. This is an eight passenger SUV in magnetic gray. And under the hood, you'll find a 3.5 liter V6 driving on 18 inch wheels. Now, some of the great exterior features on this Highlander includes fog lights, turn signals on the side mirrors, a smart key system, and a power lift gate. Helping us inside is our key fob here. It has our lock and unlock button. Like I mentioned, this Highlander does have a smart key system, so we can lock the vehicle by pressing these lines on the door handle here. To unlock it, it's as easy as putting our hand inside the door handle. In the side mirror, you do have a blind spot monitoring system. You have your power windows, locks, and mirrors in the door here. And inside, this Highlander comes equipped with black soft tech seating. And on top, you do also get a moonroof. Now, as always, we're going to take a look at the steering wheel first. You have this nice leather-wrapped steering wheel. On the bottom, you have this piano black gloss trim. If we take a look on the left side, you have features like your audio controls. You also have your hands recalling and your voice recognition system. You have these arrows here. This allows you to cycle through your multi-information display where you can look at safety features, any alerts and settings. You can also look at your uh, any audio that's playing. On the right side, you'll find your Toyota Safety Sense with lane departure alert and dynamic radar cruise control with your cruise control speed settings on the right side here. Moving on to our infotainment system. Right now we are on the home screen where it will display your trip information, any device that's connected and any audio that's playing. If we press the screen here, for example, the trip information screen, you can also look at your history as well. Going into audio and going into source, you have your standard AM and FM options. You can also connect your phone through Bluetooth, Apple CarPlay, and Android Auto. Going into reverse, gives you that backup camera as well. Bring that back into park, moving down to our climate control. It is a dual zone, so the temperatures can be adjusted on both sides. You have these nice smooth turning dials. The temperature display is in the dials, of course. On the very left and very right, you'll find your driver and passenger heated seats. Moving past the little vents here, Toyota continues to put the shelf in the Highlander, but it is split up in the center here. So you have one above the uh, glove box there and one underneath. Moving down, or actually you have this little piece here where you can run cables through and that comes down to your USB auxiliary. You also have your 12 volt outlet in here as well. You have some storage space and cup holders and behind the shifter, you will find your different drive modes. Taking a quick look inside the back, there's some storage on the bottom of the door. We are continuing with the black soft tech seating. You do get some extra storage compartments behind the front passenger and driver's seats. The rear seats do also fold down. There's a little handle here. If you pull that upwards, the seats will fold, give you access to your cargo. Now, like I mentioned, the Highlander does have a power lift gate, so we can hold that third button on our key fob. Now, if we sneak inside here, you can see even with the third row seats up, you still have plenty of storage space in the back. Third row seats do fold down. Just push these little handles forward. The seats will fold, giving you a nice flat storage space in the back here. Like I mentioned, the second row seats do fold down as well. That will always give you that extra bit of room. To close up, you can press the same button on the key fob, or you can press the little button on the lift gate, and that will close on its own. 